Nope. <laughs> They're supposed to be planes. Um. Oops. paper airplanes uh, but before we get started on that we're going to be talking about our habits and qualities for the week and they are consider and understand others and caring so for this stem activity you might be wondering how considering and understanding others or caring have anything to do um, with paper airplanes um, but i just wanted to point out how these two planes are very different um, from each other so um, in that sense, we have to be considerate of others when they have different ideas from us because maybe one one of you guys might think to make this one or somebody else might think to make this one or you know, you could maybe even add in like a rectangle or something. You could choose different shapes to make your airplane with um, but we want to be considerate of others and other people's ideas um, and that's just something that we want to keep in mind for this activity that all of your creativity is welcome and we want you guys to share that creativity with us um, so if you guys do make this stem activity uh bring it to your zoom calls show us and maybe we could see how far how or how fast your plants fly um but yeah let's get started okay so you will need a few things for this stem activity So you can cut a strip like this. You specifically want to make um, this plane right here. Um, you're gonna need one small strip like this and then you're just gonna cut another one that's a bit longer so you can make a bigger circle. So you could just take this piece of paper and cut along here or you can take another ooh, longer piece of paper and just cut along um, right here okay so now I have a bunch of different sizes of strips of paper I also just have some example um, circles right here so the main thing is again you want one to be smaller and one to be bigger um, so that you can put it onto your straw. Actually, if you wanted to experiment, you could probably see um, what difference it would make if your two shapes were the same size. Um, but I'll leave that up to you guys if you wanna do that. Um, if you want to make something like this specifically, you're just going to take a smaller strip um, and then you're gonna roll it just like that. And, and then you're just gonna take a longer strip um, and roll it up. As long as it's bigger <laughs> than the other one. And there you go. Um, I think I wanna cut my straw up to you guys what um, length of straw that you want to use but then uh, you're just gonna take your two circles and you're gonna tape that on as well make sure that it's going on straight and um, if this is a bit too difficult if you can't keep your hands steady um, you could always ask a parent or a sibling um, to help you out um, with this step um, but yeah there you go that is how well one way that we can make a paper airplane <laughs> if you guys do make this uh we'd love to see it in the zoom calls i think it'd be really cool to see what you guys come up with um because i only need circles and a triangle so maybe if somebody wants to make a rectangle or more triangles i think that'd be really cool Oops, it's falling. <laughs> Thank you.